Good morning, everyone. I'm Jan Carabeo with your morning digital news brief for Sunday, March 1st. A house fire in Bucks County has killed one person. The fire broke out early this morning on the 700 block of Sycamore Drive in Southampton. Fire crews were unable to reach that person because of the intense flames. A fire, meantime, has swept through a home in Bear, Delaware, with seven people rushed to the hospital. Firefighters got this call just before midnight to a house on Barrister Court. Two people reportedly have life threatening injuries. A neighbor, meantime, suffered minor injuries trying to help the people inside. And it's on to Super Tuesday after Joe Biden's win in the South Carolina primary. Seven candidates will battle for victories in 14 states. This follows billionaire and climate activist Tom Steyer's decision to end his campaign. Now to the eyewitness for the forecast with meteorologist Matt Peterson. Hi, Matt. Hey there, Jan. Going to be a good one for us today. We'll see sunshine across the region for Sunday. Temperatures starting to creep up a little bit more on the uh, more comfortable side as well. Of course, today starts the month of March. And it looks like, according to the National Weather Service anyway, that our temperature outlook for the month keeping us 50 to 60 percent chance that we get above average temperatures through the next 31 days here across the Delaware Valley. So after a mild February, get ready again for a warm March. Our preview temperatures by the end of the month climbing up to almost 60 degrees. Our average high on March 31st, 58 after we start the month out with average highs in the upper 40s. And we do see typically around two days of 70 degree temperatures throughout the month as well. Now, March 1st going to be again more comfortable for us afternoon today. Plenty of sunshine for our Sunday, a high right around 45 degrees. Even overnight tonight, not looking too bad. A couple of clouds pass on through. We'll start Monday with a temperature right around 36 and then clouds will increase through the day Monday afternoon, calling it a high of 60 degrees for early Monday, uh, early work week that is, and then we'll see some showers on Monday night into early Tuesday before a little bit of a break maybe on Tuesday morning and then a couple more scattered rain showers on Tuesday afternoon. Another break in the action on Wednesday and Thursday. Another system will roll on in towards the end of the week on Friday and that one could even have maybe a few wet snowflakes mixed in in areas north as well. 45 degrees for the high today, 60s Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Jan, we're looking at full sunshine by Thursday. And again, watch that second system there on the end of the week. All right, Matt, thank you. And remember, you can always get the latest news and weather headlines right here on CBSPhilly.com. I'm Jan Carabeo. Have a great day.